So you've played 11 games in the league so far. How would you sum up your sort of half-term analysis? Um, we'd like to be a bit better. I, I do think we're definitely not nine points worse off than Middlesbrough in terms of our performances. Uh, however, that is the reality at this moment in time. And we've got to wait for a few teams to drop points and to take points off of each other. I think that, that that week where we dropped seven points in a week, where we dominated three games, lost one, drew two, which I don't know how they, they were the results. They've cost us a little bit, but since then we've really started to find form, apart from the one blip with Stoke. But overall, considering we've brought in, what, seven, eight players to the first team squad, um, I've been really pleased because they're now starting to gel really nicely and the banter's there and the team spirit's there now. So obviously last Sunday you took a break from competitive action uh, and a friendly against Aston Villa. How was that to test yourself against Super League opposition? Oh, it was good. Like the, the apprentice becomes um, against the master, really, wasn't it? Though? So obviously playing against Dave and Sanks, both who have, uh, have had sort of a big input into my uh, coaching career. So today, in terms of my, from my educational side, it was good to play against them. Um, I felt that if we didn't make so many subs, we probably would have beat them quite comfortably, to be honest. I think that we outplayed them, especially in the first half, and we just, in the second half, constant changes sort of had an impact on the game. I think we looked very threatening. We had three or four, well, we didn't start probably six of our normal girls who started over recent weeks. And to only come out with a 2 1 loss, where we've hit the post and hit the bar as well, and lost and missed a few of the quite clear cut chances was. Uh, it was uh, quite, uh, quite pleasing to be fair. And then the County Cup draw, we brought it home to look for Foxes for yeah. the second time in about three weeks that you'll face them also with the League Cup game as well. What yeah. do you make of the draw? Nothing really. Um, just, we'll just go and hopefully beat them. Uh, County Cup to County Cup. I feel like it's, it's a good opportunity for us to play a lot of girls who haven't had as much minutes as they want and I feel that it should be quite a comfortable sort of day to be honest but you never know Foxes local derby they're going to definitely come with some surprises as always um, and don't want to take anything away from them and I know that they're going to going to want to beat us just as much as we want to beat them and then obviously this Sunday you travel to West Brom what do you make for that game and what are your plans three points um, we're, we're going to train we've trained really well tonight to get ourselves ready for West Brom and what we think their tactics will be like Thursday again we're going to do a few more bits of bobs just to just to hone in on what we want to get right for Sunday. Um, hopefully we'll have a new signing in the squad that day as well, um, which we're quite excited to get. Um, got a couple more on the way too. So we're hoping really to take the game to West Brom. And like I say, without taking anything from West Brom, they're the games we do need to win if we want to keep the title push going. Nothing, it means nothing being a 5-7-2 if we go next week in the next league game and lose to West Brom.